I knew it. I knew Master Lowry was going to be whack. Nerd soul. Late ill kid at one youngster, hold it down, bring that street geek and nerd soul. What is up, my people, today? Oh, yeah, coming with another wonderful episode of That's Right on Screen. Before we get started, big shout to everyone who came through at Los Angeles Comic Con. Show love to the kid. Big shout out to Nooligan, Just Scope, Ray Anthony Height, Brandon Easton, Geek Fine Art. Check out all those brothers doing a thing holding it down. Now, we gotta catch up, cause tonight we got the next episode of, of course, Black Lightning. And real quick again, I wanna touch on the family. Once again, this show, just, it really gives you that family, wholesome vibe, and how they are able to deal with their differences, but still love each other, it is, it's just a beautiful thing to see. I really love it. You know, seeing Anissa, seeing Jen, even with uh, Jefferson and Lynn, just so much, there's so much there and, and the way they play the characters, the way they act, you can see that there is history there. And even though with family, you know, there may be hurt there or there might be some harm, but they still have that love to mend those fences, to build those bridges, to remain that unit and just love it. Just had to put that there. Just, I, I totally love it. Now, your boy Tobias, oh, oh, oh. we gonna talk about that Tobias. Is Tobias the best villain in DC, CW, you know, lineups or whatever? Cause Tobias don't, he don't play. He, and when we, of course, we saw the chess moves on, you know, the prior episode, this guy is not only ruthless, but he is on top of things, namely in this case, your boy Khalil. But using this situation to get Khalil to go to go darker, you know, because I think Tobias knew like, yo, Khalil still, you know, he still got that love for that Jennifer. You know, he still got that love for that girl. We, I gotta pull him, I gotta pull him closer to the dark side. So making him go and do some work, you know what I mean? Khalil had to, he had to go a little bit, you know, a little hard body on him. And with that said, going to Khalil, is he passing a point of no return? You know, what do you think? Do you think that Jen will still be able to save his soul? I was thinking yes, but after this, man, you know, with the, with the whole family thing, with the mom thing, with Black Lightning, we'll get that to, to that in a second. Maybe not, maybe he's going to completely turn and be like, I ain't feeling it. Now, with that being said, you saw when he shot that dart and Black Lightning was like, I got it, mm-mm. Not this time playing. You saw how he eased up. He was like, oh, oh snap, it's time to go. Now, I do want to get to Lynn and everything and how it's going down with her and the new doctor or the old doctor that's been recertified or whatever. But let's talk about Master Lowry. That's right, before the jump, I gotta get into, the, big shout out to Keith Cooper or whoever in the, in the comments said that bet money, Master Lowry gonna be whack. And uh, yeah, he whack. I, <sighs> There is nothing worse than some Poindexter looking, uh, shell bean counting having. He probably wear them little hats with the green tint on them. And like, dude is so offensive and passive aggressive. You just wanna mush his head. He like one of those kids that would get smart. You wanna mush his head, you know what I'm saying? I, I wouldn't be mad if Jefferson just mushed him in the head real quick, you know, for old times sake. Uh, but of course, the board has someone in charge and in position who's gonna get those things like those metal detectors done and all that stuff. So how is Jefferson gonna deal with this? How is he gonna get through this struggle? You know what I mean? Master Lowry sunned him straight up when he even came. He was like, since I don't have an office, we can be so, look, first thing, hey, 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 watch yourself, just watch yourself. But guys, we gotta get to the hospital and we gotta get to your boy, Black Lightning. And of course, Henderson in just a second. But first, Cure Brands gonna help us pay them bills. Oh yeah, 
particularly below hat shirts, hoodies, all that jazz. And once you find something you like, of course, cop it. So let's get into the, the, the hospital with Lynn, with this new doctor. And please excuse me because I forgot her name, but crazy doctor, which is CD. We're going to call her CD crazy doctor. We know good and well. I told Lynn, it's the U.S. government. They're going to figure out either a way to make a dollar out of it or how to kill some people with it. That's, that's, all, that's how they function. You know what I'm saying? Can this be a weapon or can we sell this? And in this case, they might try to do both, try to sell weapons and kill people. But anyway, they wanted to get that extra doctor. Get some help. Get her some help from the crazy doctor. And seeing the difference between someone who I guess used to be a good doctor on one side that's in the, in the, you know, in the jail and across the table from Lynn, who is maybe slipping into a ball of confusion. Maybe she's slipping and sliding into a hole that she might not be able to climb out of because Bill Duke, yes, he's Bill Duke. I don't know his character's name. His character's name is Bill Duke because Bill Duke is probably going to slowly pull her into a situation where maybe her family will have to pull her out of because you know, he's maneuvered her in a way where she kind of is working for the government, you know, where she wasn't before. And now he has her working with this lady who is definitely not safe. So crazy that she killed patients, you know what I'm saying? Or her, her experiments got patients killed. I think she only said she only killed one. And then also she already tried to escape, mess around, got an ankle, ankle monitor hit. Lynn is between a rock and a hard place, and I don't think that the family, or Jefferson especially, is really paying attention to how bad it is. All right, guys, I got two things left, but definitely let me know below how you're feeling about Khalil's mom, how you're feeling about the fight this time, the sort of rematch between Painkiller and Black Lightning. Um, and also, Gamby got a little shine, but how are you feeling about the Anissa Robin Hood? Do you think that her character is going to be able to manage being this Robin Hood type character and being Thunder and being just regular old Anissa. Cause remember now we got Grace coming back in. She's like, can we try? Can we try? Well, I don't know, can you try? Can you, can you juggle all this? And please don't be going telling everybody you Thunder. All right, cause I know you all hype about that, bowing and giving people high fives. All right, look, I, is this gonna spread her thin? Will it? I, I don't know. Guys, holler at me and let me know what you think. And lastly, uh, you know, there's tons of stuff going on, but I really wanted to focus in on Jen and of course, Maxine Shaw, attorney at law, who in this case is playing Matrix and how their relationship is going to build. Uh, of course, we see when they first meet, Jen is not happy and she is not happy with her parents. But we do see a turn in this time that she is able to share with someone that is able to understand her, someone who is sort of disassociated from her family, maybe objective in a way where they can meet each other on a common ground. And I think this might be good for her in, you know, and in turn be good for her family because Jen might be on a line where she's like, hey, Maybe I don't hate these powers now. You know, I mean, we saw her zap her, zap her sister earlier. You know, maybe I don't hate these powers now, but I still don't know where they should go. Where should I put these powers? Where do they belong? So guys, holla at me. I'm gonna holla at you. Down in the comments, let's talk Black Lightning. And also tonight, man, I can't wait for the next episode. It's gonna, it's gonna be super hype. So before I bounce, I'm gonna tell you guys to hit up thatnerdshole.com. That's right, check me out right there. All my videos from the oldest, newest, latest, greatest, and all that. Then hit up shop.thatnerdshole.com and pick yourself up a t-shirt player. Don't forget to get one for them play X. Then come back here, like, comment, subscribe, and share that nerd soul. That's right, there's no better way that I can show people that you like what you are watching. So, LA, what up? VA, what up? RVA, you got my heart. And please be good to yourselves. Please be good to each other. And remember, if a dude comes to collect money that you owe, and he is definitely in the drug game, which means that he will hurt you, just pay the man. Peace.